At first glance, this iron meteorite looks like it needs a good cleaning or some rust removal. But you know what? It's not dirty and it's not rusted. Let's talk about what makes the Uday Station meteorite so unique. I want you to put yourself near the banks of the Benue River in Nigeria in the spring of 1927. You hear a roar, the ground shakes, there's a brilliant light in the sky, and then there's a loud boom. A few seconds later, a 100 kilogram chunk of iron slams into the earth. At first glance, the meteorite looks like other iron meteorites, but slice it open and you'll find something special. It isn't just metal. It's packed with silicate inclusions. We're talking about minerals like olivine and pyroxene and even fragments of gabbro, a coarse-grained igneous rock that forms when magma cools. That's what makes this meteorite look dirty at first glance. What we really have here is a tiny rock garden embedded inside the nickel and iron that makes up most of the mass of the stone. The neat thing here is that the inclusions tell us this wasn't just a piece of planetary core like most irons, it's mixed with crustal material too. But how does that happen? Well, it's probably the result of an impact. The iron was the core of a planet that probably no longer exists. A collision from some other large body created metal silicate melt pools where molten iron mingled with rocky debris. As the mixture cooled, the silicates became trapped within the metal and eventually gravity saw to it that the material ejected from the parent body landed here on Earth. Now, dating shows that the material formed over four and a half billion years ago, back when the solar system was still highly chaotic. Later impacts reheated and reshaped the metal and stone, but we don't quite know when that happened. What we do know is that the early solar system was something of a pinball gallery as things collided frequently and bounced around all over the place. The unique composition of this meteorite makes it visually recognizable, and it's even better that the fall was witnessed so that the stories of the meteor's journey through our atmosphere could be documented. Uday Station is a meteorite that's both scientifically and culturally important. Want to learn more about space rocks? Make sure to like the video and give me a follow.